Look, uh, Turkey is going to have relationships with all of the, of the significant powers in the world, including with Russia. But where the United States needs to have a better, more effective, more sustained dialogue with Turkey is on the question of when that cooperation gets in the way of effective military coordination within NATO. And so, for example, the S-400 system, the anti-aircraft system that Russia is selling to Turkey, it's not operable with the air defenses of our NATO allies or with the United States. This is not uh, a positive development, and the U.S. should continue to work tr to try to show Turkey that going down the path it's going down is going to start creating significant operational challenges as well as political and diplomatic challenges. And that should happen at both the military level and the civilian level. Whether we can succeed in bringing Turkey back to a more reasonable place on this set of issues, to put some right and left limits around the extent and nature of their cooperation with Russia, I can't say. But I think it's our obligation to try to do so.